Bereshit, Genesis 46, and Yahshrael took his journey with all that he had and came to Be'er Shiva and offered sacrifices unto the Elohim of his father Yitzhak. And Elohim spoke unto Yasharel in the visions of the night and said, Yaakov, Yaakov. And he said, Here am I. And he said, I am Elohim, the Elohim of your father. Fear not to go down into Mitzrayim, for I will there make of you a great nation. I will go down with you into Mitzrayim, and I will also surely bring you up again. And Yosef shall put his hand upon your eyes. And Yaakov rose up from Be'er Shiva. And the sons of Yashar El carried at Yaakov their father, and at their little ones, and at their women in the wagons which Pharaoh had sent to carry him. And they took at their cattle, and at their goods, which they had gotten in the land of Canaan, and came into Mitzrayim, Yaakov and all his seed with him. His sons and his sons' sons with him, his daughters and his sons' daughters, and all his seed brought he with him into Mitzrayim. And these are the names of the children of Yasharel, which came into Mitzrayim. Yaakov and his sons, Reuven, Yaakov's firstborn, and the sons of Reuven, Chanak, and Palu, and Chatsran, and Carmeli, rather Carmi, rather Carmi, and the sons of Shimon, Yamuel, Yamin, and Ohad, and Yakin, and Sokar, and Shaul, the son of a Kana Ani woman, and the sons of Levi, Gershon, Kohath, and Marei, and the sons of Yahuda, Ur, and Onan, and Shalak, and Peretz, and Zarak. But Ur and Onan died in the land of Canaan. And the sons of Peretz were Chetzran and Chamul, and the sons of Yishakar, Tola and Pua, and Yav and Shimran, and the sons of Zevalon, Chared and Elan, and Yakelel. These be the sons of Leah, which she bore unto Yaakov in Padan Aram, et with his daughter Dinah. All the souls of his sons and his daughters were thirty and three. And the sons of Gad, Siphon, and Chagi, Shuni, and Etzban, Ari, and Oradi and Areli, and the sons of Asher, Yimna, and Yishva, and Yishvi, and Beria, and Sarak, their sister, and the sons of Beria, Shever, and Melkilia, rather Melkiel. These are the sons of Zilpah, whom Lavan gave to Leah, his daughter. And these she bore at unto Yaakov, even sixteen souls. The sons of Rachel, Yaakov's woman, Yosef and Binyamin. And unto Yosef in the land of Mitzrayim were born at 
Menasheh and Et Ephraim, which Asenath, the daughter of Pati Farah, priest of On, bore unto him. And the sons of Benjamin were Bila and Becker and Ashbel, Jera and Naaman, Iki and Roash, Mupi and Chupim and Ard. These are the sons of Rachel, which were born to Yaakov. All the souls were 14. And the sons of Dan, Chushim. And the sons of Naphtali, Yak, Se'el, and Guni, and Yetzer, and Shilem. These are the sons of Bilha, which Lavan gave unto Rachel, his daughter. And she bore these et unto Yaakov. All the souls were seven. All the souls that came with Yaakov into Mitzrayim, which came out of his loins, besides Yaakov's sons, women, all the souls were threescore and six. And the sons of Yosef, which were born in Mitzrayim, were two souls. All the souls of the house of Yaakov, which came into Mitzrayim, were threescore and ten. And he sent at Yahuda before him unto El Yosef to direct his face unto Goshen. And they came into the land of Goshen. And Yosef made ready his chariot and went up to meet at Yashrael, rather Yasharel, his father, to Goshen, and presented himself unto him. And he fell on his neck and wept on his neck a good while. And Yasharel said unto El Yosef, Now let me die, since I have seen at your face, because you, because your are yet alive. And Yosef said unto his brethren and unto his father's house, I will go up and show Pharaoh and say unto him, My brethren and my father's house, which were in the land of Canaan, are come unto me. And the men are shepherds, for their trade has been to feed cattle. And they have brought their flock and their herds and all that they have. And it shall come to pass when Pharaoh shall call you and shall say, What is your occupation? That ye shall say, Your servant's trade has been about cattle from our youth even until now, both we and also our fathers, that ye may dwell in the land of Goshen. For every shepherd is an abomination unto the Mitzrayim.